Hey everybody, welcome to Beyond the Body. In this video, we will uncover 10 low salt diet tips. Make sure to watch until number one because this tip is the most important one of all. Now be sure to watch everything to get all the value in this video. And before we get started, be sure to click the link in the description for our number one weight loss recommendations. And also, hit the like and subscribe button, turn on the notification bell icon, and let's get started. What is a low salt diet? For those who don't know, Eating a low salt diet is a great way to maintain a healthy lifestyle and can help reduce the risk of certain health problems, such as high blood pressure. Low salt diets are recommended for some people, particularly those with existing heart or kidney conditions, because when consuming excess, salt can cause water retention and increase the strain on these organs. A low salt diet involves eating less than one tablespoon of added salt each day and replacing salty snacks with fresh vegetables and fruit. Low salt crackers and small amounts of low sodium, cheese, peanuts, or other nuts. With careful considerations of food labels, it's possible to still enjoy tasty meals while reducing your overall sodium intake for improved health. Check out these 10 low salt diet tips. Number 10, eat plenty of fresh fruits and vegetables. Eating plenty of fresh fruits and vegetables can provide numerous benefits to our health. These nutrient dense foods are packed with vitamins, minerals, antioxidants, and other beneficial compounds that help promote physical and mental well-being. Recent research suggests that increased consumptions of fruits and vegetables may reduce the risk of stroke, heart disease, and other illnesses, in addition to providing essential nutrients for our bodies. These colorful plant-based ingredients also add flavor and texture to our meals without the need for a lot of calories or fat. Including a variety of fresh produce in your diet is an easy way to ensure you're getting the maximum amounts of nutrition to keep your body functioning optimally. Eating plenty of fresh fruits and vegetables is one of the best things you could do for your health. Going on a low salt diet has many benefits, but it would be wise to supplement that by adding in loads of fresh fruits and vegetables. Not only do they provide essential vitamins and minerals, but they are also very low in sodium. Eating a variety of them will add flavor and color to all your meals, as well as provide you with an array of health-boosting benefits. So if you're looking for a way to improve your diet, start stocking up on fresh produce today. Number 9. Avoid processed foods Eating a diet full of processed foods can be the biggest factor in weight gain, developing chronic illnesses, and poor overall health. Processed foods are typically low in nutrition and contains many ingredients that have been linked to serious health risk. The best way we can improve our health is by avoiding processed foods and shopping for fresh ingredients whenever possible. Eating a more balanced diet has numerous benefits, such as improved energy levels, boosted immunity, and fewer cravings. So making healthier choices at the grocery store is one of the best things you can do for your body. Now, eating a low-sodium diet is one of the best ways to avoid processed foods and improve overall health. Eating fewer processed foods can help reduce cardiovascular disease risk and obesity, lower blood pressure, and increase the risk of diabetes. Furthermore, people eating a low-sodium diet are less likely to suffer from poor digestion. With so many good reasons for avoiding processed foods, why not make it part of a low-sodium diet plan? Eating natural, unprocessed foods can provide individuals with numerous essential vitamins, minerals, and nutrients that can help keep them healthy and energized on a daily basis. Incorporating low-sodium meals into your everyday routine is an easy and delicious way to improve your overall well-being. With a few simple tips and some knowledge about which food labels to watch out for, you can take control of your diet and make sure what you consume is good for you. Number 8. Cut back on sodium-rich condiments like soy sauce and salad dressings. Reducing the amount of sodium-rich condiments you consume can help you improve your dietary habits. Soy sauce and salad dressings are a common source of excess salt in many people's diet. But by eating less or using these ingredients in smaller quantities, you can benefit from cutting back. Sodium has been linked to increased hypertension, which is why the moderate intake is recommended for general health and well-being. Think about making healthy substitutions for these items in order to add flavor without as much sodium, like herbs, spices, and citric juice. 
a balanced diet full of fresh fruits and vegetables should be at the core of your nutritional strategy. By removing the extra sodium from soy sauce and other condiments, you can meet your health goals faster. Number seven, limit your intake of salty snacks like chips and pretzels. Eating too many salty snacks like chips and pretzels can have a direct negative impact on your health in the form of high blood pressure and unhealthy weight gain. Fortunately, limiting your intake of these types of foods is simple. Start by giving yourself an allotted amount that you are allowed to have each week and stick with it. Additionally, replace them with more nutritious yet still satisfying snacks like vegetables with hummus as they can be just as delicious while benefiting your health. It may be tempting to snack on chips and pretzels, but by finding a healthy alternative, you will not only be improving your well-being, but also setting yourself up for long-term success. Number six, choose lean protein sources like grilled chicken or fish instead of deadly meats. Eating a balanced diet that includes lean protein sources such as grilled chicken or fish is essential for optimum health. Choosing these healthier protein sources instead of processed deadly meats can provide numerous nutritional benefits. Lean proteins can help you feel full longer and maintain a stable level of energy throughout the day due to their slow releasing carbohydrates. Eating lean proteins is also generally lower in calories than other options and provides important minerals and vitamins that support optimum physical performance. Grilled chicken and fish are great options when it comes to getting the protein that you want without sacrificing nutrition. Unlike deli meats, which can be laden with saturated fats, unhealthy preservatives, and nitrates, Grilled chicken and fish offer all the satisfaction and health benefits of other proteins but without any of those problematic ingredients. Whether it is a salad topper or dinner centerpiece, considering a lean protein option first will always lead to healthier choices that can go a long way towards improving overall wellness. Incorporating lean protein sources into your diet like grilled chicken and fish can give your studies and workout an energy boost while helping you stay on track with your dietary goals. Number five, make your own meals as often as possible to control the amounts of salt in them. Making your own meals is an excellent way to remain conscious of the salt you are consuming. Not only does it increase the possibility of you eating healthier, but it also helps to ensure that ingredients such as salt are used in proportionally moderated amounts. Oftentimes when we eat out or have food from the store, Unnecessary salt can be added in order to make it taste better. By creating meals at home, you have full control over the amounts of seasoning and can adjust it to meet both your preference and health needs. In fact, cooking at home not only allows for more control over sodium consumptions, but most likely can stretch your budget further as well. Number four, drink plenty of water throughout the day to stay hydrated. Staying hydrated throughout the day is incredibly important for overall health. Hydration helps with cell regenerations, brain function, and digestion. It's best to take in water throughout the day rather than all at once as that can be too taxing on our bodies. Also, choose low sugar or low calorie drinks if you don't want to consume only water. Low sugar is especially beneficial as part of a low salt diet. Not only does it help your body absorb nutrients and flush out waste, but it can also help regulate several body functions such as temperature and blood pressure. Additionally, drinking enough water can improve athletic performance and aid in digestion. Start your day by drinking a glass of warm water and once your body gets used to taking in fluids regularly, it will become an easier habit to maintain. Number three, read food labels carefully to make sure you're not eating too much salt. Eating a low salt diet is essential for many reasons, not only to reduce our risk of high blood pressure, but to look after our overall well-being. Unfortunately, most processed and prepackaged foods contain too much salt, so it's important to read food labels carefully to make sure that we are not over-consuming sodium. The recommended daily intake of sodium for a healthy adult is 2,300 milligrams per day, according to the U.S. Dietary Guidelines. This amount is about one teaspoon of salt. Check the nutrition facts labels for the serving size and compare it with the recommended daily allowance. You'll be surprised how quickly this can add up. Remember, the less your sodium intake is, the healthier you will be in the long run. Number two, avoid drinking alcohol, which can dehydrate you and contribute to high blood pressure levels. Many people are unaware of the health risk associated with alcohol consumptions. Not only can drinking be addictive, but it can also lead to dehydration and worsen high blood pressure levels. Remember that your body needs water to stay healthy and hydrated. Drinking alcohol means it is not getting enough H2O. Even if you think you're in the clear by having just a few drinks, 
The reality is that alcohol has an effect on your body regardless of how much of it you consume. Moreover, the effects of alcohol-induced dehydration may be increased in certain individuals depending on their existing health factors. To avoid this effect, it is important to 1. Stick to a low-salt diet and 2. Reduce consumption or eliminate drinking alcohol altogether. This will ensure that your sodium intake and fluid levels are kept in balance while protecting your cardiovascular health in the long run. To maintain optimum health, try abstaining from drinking altogether or do so sparingly after weighing the risk involved. Number one, get regular exercise to help control blood pressure levels. Exercise can play a crucial role in maintaining health blood pressure levels. Low impact aerobic activities such as walking and swimming are great choices for getting the heart rate up and helping to control your numbers. Additionally, it's important to eat a low salt diet to keep your pressure low. Eating foods low in sodium, like fresh fruits and vegetables, is more beneficial than low calorie alternatives as they are nutrient dense and give the body essential vitamins and minerals, while also controlling blood pressure levels. Finally, consider regular exercise as an effective method of keeping your blood pressure under control. Check out this video Top 10 inverted row variations, calisthenics, and I'll see you in the next video. Have a great day.